guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome i know the setup has sort of changed i'm trying to do this new sort of setup thingy majiggy for when i do my clothing hauls welcome back to another video um, if you're new here welcome to my channel i'm hannah i do videos here on youtube three times a week sunday wednesday and a friday and sadly today's video can't be a try on haul which is something i wanted but hey ho can't always get what you want so today's video as you can see from the title do you like my little like scene there i do so today's video is a misguided and femme luxe well mini femme luxe more of a misguided haul this video is not sponsored by the way not at all tall girl for those who didn't know and you're new to my channel or if you have if you're not new to my channel and you've never seen my videos before or you don't know this but i am six foot two so i am extremely tall for my age i should say that um or in general for a lady i'm finding clothes is extremely dif difficult especially because my torso is really long and my legs are extremely long so finding clothes that fit me is a nightmare and the only place i can actually find tall clothing is on misguided i've tried misguided trousers before i absolutely love them their length is amazing so if you have longer lengths sort of like 34 to 36 inch in length then i would 100 percent recommend getting misguided clothing so i have a mahusive bag of misguided goodies that i'm going to go through two of the items i'm just going to show you quickly because i bought this at I bought this during uh, Black Friday, so I thought I might as well just show you. So the first item that I picked up, this video, by the way, is not just sponsored, as I've just said. The first item that I have picked up is, I don't know if you can see, is this just, uh, I don't think this is in the tool section. I'm not 100% sure. I don't think it is because Miss Guy didn't normally have tool here. So this is just like a more camel borg teddy coat. Um, so this is in the size 10. It's really, really comfortable. I've worn this a couple of times. The two items I'm going to show you here are coats. I have worn these like religiously. I absolutely love it. The quality of this Borg teddy coat. Now I know everyone says, oh Hannah, um, like you're following the trends, doing whatever, but I don't care. I really, really like this jacket. Um, it's sort of like, it's not too, too long. It's got cute pockets. The pockets actually are pretty huge. So you can fit quite a lot in the pockets. Um, but yeah, I really, really like the quality of this. It doesn't like fluff up or anything like that. It's really, really nice quality, especially if you're tall like me. Um, I tend to, I think this, I don't know if this is in the tool section or not. I try to link everything in the description. If it's not, then it's not. But if it is, then I'll link it in the description. I'm not, don't quote me. I don't know, actually remember if it's in the tool section or not. But yeah, I just think, Miss Guy did do such good lengths. Like, if you want it to be small, it'll be small. But if you want it to be bigger and longer, then it will be bigger and longer. So, yeah, especially, it's good that I'm showing you this, especially because I'm a tall girl. It's a lot easier for you guys to get an idea of how their sizing is. So, this is a size 10. It's just an average coat. Um, it has a zip up. Yeah, it just has a zip up. I really, really like the quality of this. The quality is really, really nice. Um, it's very much an autumn spring type of coat i love the color i wasn't too sure on the color originally but i really really do love the color so this was around on, on black friday i think this is around 22 pound 50 but i know it's shot up back to its original price which is around 40 to 50 pounds can't remember which is a little bit expensive for a board coat because you can but then you can find them in primark and primark are about 30 quid anyway so yeah i think when i got this for 25 pounds or 22 pounds or something like that i thought that was a really good bargain okay so next onto a coat that i'm absolutely obsessed with when i saw this was in the tool section it was labeled tall i think this they do this anyway in the normal section but i was so glad i got this i was so skeptical on whether i wanted it because of the color um was it going to be too big on me was it going to drown me out and whatnot but no i'm absolutely obsessed with it i got this in more of a bigger size because i wanted to be a bit more baggy because if you don't know i love baggy clothing joggers um oversized t-shirts oversized jumpers like this one's from boohoo they are all me like that is a hannah clo or hannah outfit so this coat right here i've worn this religiously i can't even show you this is one of their oversized like puffer jacket sort of things so i can't really show you but it's just a cream puffer jacket with a gray inside i've been using this so much let me put it on for you i've been loving this jacket i got this i got this in a size 12 and I just think, like, this jacket is everything. Like, this jacket, obviously, not, probably not with this outfit, but this jacket's everything. The hood is, like, really, really nice. If you're one of those typical, like, Yeezy, or if you're into that really, like, bougie, but bougie, like, style, then this is definitely for you. I love it. It keeps really, really warm. The pockets are amazing. I got this for £25. It's originally around about £50 to £60. Um, I got this in £25, again, on Black Friday, so... 
yeah they normally misguided always tend to have sales anyway so this was an absolute bargain like i've literally if you guys have seen me in person or you're my friends and you're watching as you guys know i'll be literally ri like rinsing this coat out because i love it okay so on to the actual things that i bought i actually bought this stuff on boxing day um online do it online because i thought do you know what why don't i treat myself to a bit of clothes so we have this mahusive oh bag right here there's not many too many things in here but i thought i might as well show you so the first item i have like opened these so they're a bit messy the first item i'm a little bit disappointed about because it the, the image of the model completely deceived me bearing in mind i'm a tall girl so like it's gonna be a mess anyway but i thought for the rest of the items it wasn't didn't deceive me but this item did now i know when they say cropped Sometimes cropped can still be a little bit longer, but this was cropped, cropped. So I thought, do you know what? Because it said cropped, I'd get a bigger size, so it'd be more baggier on me or a bit longer. But no, 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 no. So this item right here, the so this right here is the grey notch neck sweatshirt in the size medium. So yeah, I reason why I saw this was because it looked a little bit longer than a typical cropped jumper. It had this beautiful v-neck as you can see right here and I really really like this. However, it's so short. When I tried this on, it literally goes up to like just underneath my boob area and I'm like, no honey, like I don't like wearing cropped stuff. I like to be really modest, I like to be really like closed off not closed off but this is too too just for me this is just way too too cropped for me i probably could maybe style this but it's not really my thing i wanted it to be a little bit longer so just a tad bit longer maybe to around here in length but yeah it's not really my sort of thing it's a little bit too short the arm length is pretty decent like but i don't know it's not really my thing i'm not really a cropped fan i like cropped if it's a little bit sh just a tiny bit short like a tiny bit cropped but not cropped where it's like you literally can see a whole belly because i have a long torso and wide hips so it just it's not, not that it's not flattering it's just i don't really like to show that area of my body if you know what i mean so yeah this was a big no for me however the quality feels really nice um this was around 14 pounds or something on sale i think it was originally like 16 or 17 pounds but yeah got this for 14 pounds gonna probably send this back but yeah the next item right here is the black what's it called the black zip detailed sweatshirt now i really really like this i was once i saw the gray um cropped t-shirt i was just like of oh, the sweatshirt sorry i was like oh my god please tell me that the rest of these clothes are not going to be like extremely cropped but this wasn't. I was so glad. I got this in a size 10. I'm always around a size 10. If I go in coat, sometimes I get a size 12 just because I'm taller and I like that baggy feel. I can go for an 8 sometimes if it's a 10 to 8, but that's about it. I'm normally around a 10. That's what the t-shirt looks like. It's just an everyday. This is more of a basic, but I really, what I really liked about this, one, because it's long-sleeved. I, ne I needed a black long sleeve top. Two, because the material is like so nice. I can't really describe it. It's, it's like thin, but it's thick at the same time sort of thing it's not the typical t-shirt it's a bit thicker than a typical t-shirt but what was really nice is it has this zip detailing at the front so at the front you can at the front you can zip it down so it's really flattering if you want to go on a night out or if you've got an event that you go into and you just want to wear this with a pair of jeans or a pair of camo trousers or style it however you want to style it i just really really like the look of this i wanted something simple and black because staple pieces the, this is more like a staple piece for me. I'd probably be wearing the hell out of this. So I thought, you know what? I'll pick it up because it was around 13 or 14 pounds, maybe around that, maybe around a 10 or 11. I can't exactly remember the prices and on the receipt, it doesn't have the prices. So yeah, I got this in a size 10. I really, really like this. Sorry, I'm not really demonstrating how they look, but it's just like a, just a plain black t-shirt um, or like long sleeve sweatshirt. It's a little bit like sweatshirt material, but a bit thinner than your typical jumper sweatshirt, if you know what I mean. So yeah, it just has the zip detail. It doesn't go down too far, which is nice. It doesn't go too cleaverage, but yeah, you can obviously adjust the zips, which I really like. Okay, next we have this mocha, what is it called? A mocha shoulder over the side. What? Mocha shoulder oversized top. Now, it, on the label, it actually says camel colour. Now, I don't think this is a camel colour at all. I get what they mean when they say mocha, but it's more of like a blush pink in a sense. Um, yeah, it's more like a blush pink. Now, if you guys should know me already, I'm absolutely obsessed 
and in love with oversized tops that's just me like you're gonna see in my videos i'm gonna have loads and loads of oversized t-shirts plain t-shirts slogan t-shirts slogan sweatshirts that is just hannah in a box so yeah this is a mocha a sort of do you see what i mean but it's sort of like a rosy blush deeper mocha pink yeah um, so yeah, this is just an oversized top. I got this in the size 10 as usual. I like it to be baggy. I've tried this on and it looks so pretty on. Um, this would go really, really nice with this type of look. This is like a New Year's Eve look that I'm going for. Um, yeah, so this is just what it looks like. What should I put it on this side? This is what it just looks like. It's got like a typical, just an average oversized t-shirt. Really, really nice, really, really long. Obviously, of course, when you've got the length, you're able to like tie it up so it looks more like a cropped-ish style that's what i just love i love that to be able to have more length so then i could shorten it or lengthen it so yeah i absolutely love this the quality is really really good i've always loved um this is just typical misguided quality i really really love this i don't think this was in the tall section i'm not 100 percent sure it doesn't say tall so yeah this is in a size 10. the models on misguided are always wearing a size 8 so i sort of go up by one it's just for the length and just for the bagginess i love baggy clothes so yes I bought this co-ward set. It's like a jogger and t-shirt. However, like you can mix and match. It was just the same. Basically what it was, it was the same color item, but in trousers and in a t-shirt. So I've got these, so I got these burgundy joggers with the burgundy oversized t-shirt. Now there was um the burgundy t-shirt in like the black t-shirt version. So the one with the zip down, but I thought, no, I don't want that. I want a really oversized t-shirt so like sort of like airport vibes when you're going away and you just want something baggy you just want something to easy throw on and easy throw off i got this burg oh my god the quality of these joggers this guided joggers are incredible now these were also on sale everything on here was on sale but i don't know if they still got a sale now misguided especially if you're a student you can always get misguided discount anyway so yeah these are just it's just too long to show you to be honest these are just some um plain burgundy joggers there's not really much to say they're really long i think this was in the tall section just ribbed at the bottom these fit beautifully now i have around a 36 inch length leg oh that was a tongue twister um so yeah i have like a 36 i've got two no i haven't got on my teeth um but yeah this is like a th i'm around a 36 length and this fits perfectly of course Joggers tend to shrink. I don't know if these will, but yeah, I absolutely love these. I got these in a size 10. Um, I tend to have really, really wide hips, and so my hips are around 12 to 14, but my waist is a size, I think, eight, six to eight. Love these joggers. They're just elastic waist. They don't have the pulleys, which sometimes I like, because these fit so well on my waist, I don't need to, and I normally bring these up above my hips onto like my high waist, and they still are long enough for me. So yeah, 100% they've got pockets, which I really, really like. They're quite deep they're typical like um joggers these feel better than these feel better quality than even like nike or adidas tracksuits so yeah, if you're looking for some cheap affordable blo um joggers bloggers joggers that are really really good quality yeah, and these last for a got long god time time then definitely these and to twin with that or to go with that i bought in the same color a burgundy oversized sweatshirt like a t-shirt now when i got this i got this in a size 10 and it was oversized and it was really big now don't get me wrong this is quite huge so maybe just size what your size is but i actually like that it's super huge now it is literally super super duper huge but i love that because i'm really thin because i'm thinner than the average girl because i'm really tall i'm really thin etc when i wear baggy clothing it emphasizes my um shape a little bit and that's just personal preference like these biggie baggy oversized jumpers they make you look bigger than what i actually am do you see what i'm saying they make you look bigger so um which is just my personal preference but yeah, this, again, like I was saying with my other um, oversized t-shirt, you can like uh, tie them up, make them into sort of like a crop top. In a sense, you can style them however you want to style them. If I was had a try on haul, I would show you how I'd style them, but I don't have the time, so I do apologise. But I'm hoping in the future that my videos will be try on hauls as well. So yeah, this is just a really, really nice material, just like the mocha one. A little bit thicker and a little bit like... Um, how do I explain it? More coloured in a sense where it's like not a see-through in a sense. But yeah, I really love this. The arms go down to about here. So it's like a really oversized crop top Yeezy vibe. I love it. so, And I especially love the burgundy colour. Like it's just a little bit of me. Now lastly, we have one of my favourite items from Miss Guided. Before we go on to Femlux. Now, when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, it's £27 from like 50 or 40 or £50. Pounds. 
and I thought I love this this is me now I'm of course with the trendy days of a ball coat um, I saw this and I saw this on Instagram a uh, misguided Instagram and I was like I have to get this now um, it wasn't oversized and this was cropped so I went up bigger than what I was going to be so originally I would have bought a 10 but because it was cropped and it's a jumper they tend to not be too stretchy so I got a 12 now reason why obviously because of the length the reason the only reason why I get 12 and upwards is because of length not because of width so yeah this right here now I love this like don't tell me you don't love this like when I saw this on the model I was like oh my goodness so this right here what do they call it uh, a white cropped overhead ball jacket so this is more of a jumper because it's not really a jacket but yeah this is what it looks like like honestly I feel like I'm going away to like a snow land or something like that so yeah it's just a typical white creamish ball jacket it's got a hood and it's actually got these bits with like velcro here a zip not all the way down but only half and it has the illusion of a pocket like I don't even know if I'll be able to show you so it's just like got an illusion of a pocket right here. I've, has it actually got a pocket? No, I don't think so. I was hoping that it did, but it doesn't. And it's got long sleeves. These long sleeves fit me so well because my arms are bloody long. So yeah, this fits so nicely. It's a little bit shorter because it's cropped, but I like that because then you can wear like um, camo joggers or um, some jeans or some joggers or some um, like canva, like cargo pants. So like, yeah this was a massive win for me this is the what i was most excited with my misguided haul because i thought you know what this looks banging well i do have a referral code this isn't sponsored or anything i do have like a refer a friend code so if you want five pound off i know it's only five pound but it can help some people if you want five pound off misguided then the link is in the description just to refer me and you can get five pound off your order now on to femlux so femlux kind of contacted me was like we'd love to collaborate with you pick out a few items and whatnot because the reason why is i want to start doing more fashion posts on my instagram now my instagram is um, growing rapidly like you guys are just absolutely amazing I love all of you and I want to start incorporating fashion posts as well as like makeup because I love fashion as well as makeup now right now I do like typical eye shots makeup videos and whatnot but I thought I see other influencers and other bloggers incorporating fashion posts into their Instagram so I thought why not I do that too so um, yeah please follow my Instagram so you can see more of like these how I style these items and etc um, my Instagram will be at the start of the video and it will definitely be in the description so please please follow me on there and I'm very active so if you have any questions and I don't reply to your comment then please just DM me I'm always active on my Instagram so yeah Femnot's kind of contact me is like girl pick out some items so I thought okay girl I'm gonna pick out some items um so yeah I picked out three things because I was worried about the sizing because they don't have a tool section as of yet and they're a smaller newer brand so I thought you know what I'll go with things that like leggings tend to fit me whatever the like normal length or tall length um long jumper dresses tend to fit me anyway because they can come off as a jumper and normal t-shirts tend to fit me anyway first item that I picked up is this grey knitted oversized polo neck jumper in the colour poly. I actually got this in a size medium to large. I've not seen these like unwrapped or anything. But yeah, I think from what I saw, this has a rollo, like it's a rollo neck on the top. Okay, so from first impressions, this isn't too bad, but the rollo neck's a little bit big, like the turtleneck's a little bit wide now i didn't want to go for a 10 to t um like a small um, a small to medium there needs to be like a medium so there needs to be a small to medium a medium and a medium to large just so there's an interval but yeah this is just what it looks like to me this isn't a jumper dress at all and i don't mean that in a shady way i just mean this is a 12 to, this is a 12 to 14 and this is huge not even huge this is quite small so i'm glad i've got this because if i've got this in a t an 8 to 10 like there needs to be an 8 to 10 and a 10 to 12 and then a 12 to 14 like there can't be an 8 to 10 and then a 12 to 14 you need a middle size they smell a bit mm, they have a smell to them but that's absolutely fine um the arm length looks a tad short for me but that's okay i can probably start this with a coat on top um but yeah, it, it, on the model, it looked, obviously she's probably a lot smaller than me, bless her. But yeah, I just gone by what the model was wearing. I knew she was going to be a lot smaller because women tend to be, not in a patronising way, but just in general, women tend to be a lot smaller. So I thought, do you know what? I'd go for a, a medium to large and this is what it looks like. It's just an everyday like ribbed 
jumper. The material feels really nice. It feels really, really warm. I think this is around £19. It's on offer now. I think everything's on sale. So it's on sale for about £19 or £20. So yeah, I'll grab this. I've not tried it on. So like all the misguided stuff I've tried on. So I've, I've told you about that, but I haven't tried this on. So you'll be able to see from my Instagram post what I think of this, but the material feels really, really nice. And I love this color of gray, like the shade of gray is just beautiful. I thought, do you know what, to go with that ribs jumper, because I've never really like had this pet type before. Now I've picked up leather leggings as well from um, Femlux. These leggings in a size 10, and these are like a leather type leggings, or they're more disco-ish than anything. Oh, these are actually nice. Okay, these are actually quite nice. I wasn't expecting that to be honest. This would be really nice to an event if you go into an event. Um, I actually quite like this. I think the ten looks, the waist looks pretty decent for me because this will go high waisted. The length is pretty decent. I don't know if these are stretchy at all because leather leggings tend to not be. But yeah, they just feel like a typical legging material. They're probably a little bit tighter than an average legging. But yeah, this these look really really nice, like the typical leathering leather <laughs> leather feel to them. So I cannot wait to wear these. You, you guys will be seeing looks from me in the upcoming days and weeks. This would just be a cute outfit, like with a nice pair of boots or something. Is that just me? Or see from Femlux, we just picked up an everyday crop top, and this has like the typical Vogue on it. So I thought, you know what, let's Hannah, let's just be like everyone else and buy a Vogue top. Now I know these are really really popular. Now I got this in a medium to large because it's cropped. So, I'm dreading this, and yeah, so, oh, whoa, this looks small. Is this a medium to large? Okay, so this is a 12 to 14, and this looks incredibly big. I mean, incredibly small, why am I getting my words wrong? Like, this looks incredibly small, don't you think? Like, okay. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for that, but you know what, we'll make it work. It is a tad, a tad, I don't know if you can see, a tad see-through. I kind of like this. It's pretty, I'm gonna make it work. Even if it's something I'm just lounging at home, I will make it work. So yeah, I really like this. This is around £4.99 on sale now, and the leggings are £9.99 on sale, or these pounds in that way. So yeah, that's what the t-shirt looks like. So that was everything in my Misguided and Femlux haul. I'm hoping to do a lot more of these, so stay tuned for that. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a massive thumbs up. Let me know what other shops you want me to buy from, whether it's Pretty Little Thing, whether it's more Misguided stuff, whether it's Boohoo, give me some names underneath and I can do some hauls for you I'm hoping to do a Primark one pretty soon so yeah if there's any like good things in Primark please let me know if you have any questions or any like questions <laughs> then please let me know in the comment section I'll be happy to get back to you if you want that misguided link then it's in my description I'll try to link all the items in my description if I don't do it when this video is originally out so when it's live then I'll try to do it in the upcoming days. I love all of you. I hope you guys all take care and I shall see you in my next video. Bye.